So we have an ellipse graphed right over here. What we're going to try to do is find the equation for this ellipse. So like always, pause this video and see if you can figure it out on your own. All right, so let's just remind ourselves the form of an equation of an ellipse. So let's say our ellipse is centered at the point. So I'm going to speak in generalities first, and then we'll think about the specific numbers for this particular ellipse. So let's say the center is at the point h comma k. And let's say that you have a horizontal radius. So the radius in the x direction, horizontal radius, radius is equal to a. And let's say your vertical radius, let's say your vertical radius, radius is equal to b. Then your, the equation of this ellipse is going to be, is going to be x minus h, x minus h squared over your horizontal radius squared, so your radius in the x direction squared, plus, plus, now we'll think about what we're doing in the vertical direction, y minus the y minus the y coordinate of our center, so y minus k squared over the vertical radius squared, b squared, is equal to one, is equal to one. So what are h and k and a and b in this situation? Well, h and k are pretty easy to figure out. The center of this ellipse is at the point, see the x coordinate is negative four, and the y coordinate is three. So this right over here is negative four, and this right over here is positive three. And what is a going to be? Well, a is your horizontal radius, your radius in the horizontal direction, so it's the length of this line right over here. And we can see it's one, two, three, four, five units long. So a in this case is equal to five. So this is going to be five squared. And b is our radius in the vertical direction. We can see it's one, two, three, four units. So b is equal to four. So that is four. So we can rewrite this as, we could rewrite this as x minus negative four and we can simplify that in a second. x minus negative four squared over five squared over our horizontal radius squared. So it's going to be 25 plus y minus three squared, y minus the y coordinate of our center, y minus three squared over our vertical radius squared. So b squared is going to be 16, and that is going to be equal to one. And of course, we could simplify this a little bit. If I subtract a negative, that's the same thing as adding a positive. So I can get rid of, I can just, instead of saying x minus negative four, I could just say x plus four. And there you have it. We have the equation for this ellipse.